If I put the shift lever down to go into first, the pawl goes up, we're in first. Okay, great. Now let me put the shift lever back up, pawl goes down into neutral. Now the reason why this issue is intermittent for me is because when I downshift and then I let go, notice how the pawl gets stuck there. Now if I rev match downshift and give the bike some time to coast, maybe five, six seconds, the vibration of the engine will actually, you know, bring the pawl back to the neutral state, then I can downshift again. Um, if I try to downshift too quickly, then obviously, you know, the pole is stuck here, so all I end up doing is this. Okay, um, I didn't, I don't see any bending of the pole, or I, I checked out the shepherd spring, I was able to take that out, put that back in, and it looks all good. Let me show you um, the shift, um, the shaft play. All right, let me get this hook back here and pull. So I don't know if this amount of play is normal. This is this is all that there is. This is all the shaft play in and out, left and right, that there is. So I'm, I'm hoping that this is normal. I'm hoping that that nut on the other side, inside the engine case, isn't loose. So any other tips would be greatly appreciated. I'm really hoping I can figure this out and not have to rely on taking it to the dealer. Let me show you one thing, one idea I was thinking about. So if I downshift more aggressively and, and, and quickly, it seems to be working right now. Granted, the oil's out and the case is open, but let me just show you what that what I mean. Wait, let me put it neutral. Okay. So if I just, like, it, it if, if I do it that hard, it, it's like there's enough momentum or whatever for that pull to get back to the return to the neutral state. So, like, maybe do I just downshift like that from now on? I'm, I'm, I'm really outside my, my league here. I don't know.